does this look like the kind of shot you've been hitting in the sand lately? Well, if it is, I have some help. Hi, my name is Paul Giordano. I'm a PGA golf professional and a first tee coach here at the beautiful Mashaloo Golf Course, home of the first tee of Metropolitan in New York. Let me show you my tip. Let's get started. First, I want to make sure that I have the right club. I've selected either a sand wedge or a lob wedge. The reason for this club is that it has what's called bounce. Bounce lets the club slide on the sand instead of digging. Next, I want to make sure that when I set up to the ball, I'm going to position it forward like I'm going to hit a tee shot. I'm going to take the toe of the club, face it up, and turn it to the right to the 1 o'clock position, and then work my feet into the sand facing the 11 o'clock position. I'm going to pick a point about an inch and a half to two inches behind the ball and strike that point first prior to hitting the golf ball, trapping some sand between the club face and the golf ball. The length of my backswing will dictate the length of the shot and always swing to the finish making sure that I splash some sand out onto the putting surface. Kind of goes like this. So next time you need to hit it close on the final hole of a tough match or to shoot your best score ever, try this simple tip and knock it tight. And by the way, tell them the Sandman sent you.